All right, everybody. I'm just here for a really, really quick short one. Shout out to my wonderful mod Chico who gave me the heads up on this update. If you guys have been following us on the uh, Dr. William Burke gynecologist situation, the slap that was heard all over and went viral. Uh, I'm going to give you guys an update. Uh, and, and this is an article from the Daily Mail. We'll watch the video one more time to refresh everybody's memory. Let me see if I can share it right now. I just had it up. I don't know why I closed it down. Lord, it's Monday. Okay. No, 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 no. This motherfucker sexually assaulted my wife seven years ago. So you have to be a fucking man, motherfucker. Now, now you know. You know what you did. You know your wife and you touched my wife. Seven years ago in New York. Don't be a ass, bitch. And this is all that makes you like to sexual assault women. That's you, bitch. Be a fucking man. Be a fucking man. You know my idea. Be a fucking man. You have to quit. Beautiful and talented women right here working with you. And seven years ago, you touched my wife and be your Don't be an asshole, motherfucker. I thought this is gonna see what kill you. You have to miss this America. Because this is gonna see what kill you. Yeah, intense. You can call fucking security and police. I don't give a fuck. Now I'm a bitch. Seven years I'm waiting for this. Seven years I'm waiting for my wife is suffering because you are a fucking predator. And you know what you did. Don't be a fucking bitch. Don't be a fucking bitch. You know what you did. You touched my wife. It's the best day of her life. But she can't have done You are fucking ass. You lucky that I don't kill you. Last one more time. Last one more time. Last one more time. Just a refresher from yesterday's video, guys. So you guys are aware there's an update. And now I'm just checking I out. Him to the press and the policy of so she reported. Remember that. There's a better way to do it. You sexually assault my wife. There's a better way to do it. No, I don't want to. I don't want to. Don't you want for a shot? Just press shot of his feet. Get up the phone. Okay. I mean, they completely give out the information of where this doctor's from, all this other stuff. So everybody's aware of who is this doctor. All right. Let me give you guys an update. So I, I actually have two updates on this. Now this is starting to make a little bit of sense as far as who's behind this viral video, too. Oh, Lord, have mercy. The things are kind of coming together. So shout out to Chico who sent me this said exclusive from the daily mail i don't even know who he is gynecologist slapped on stage by irate man at medical conference says he will press charges but refuses to address attackers claims he sexually assaulted his wife in 2016 now we have a year so seven years ago i guess that would be 2016 Speaking to DailyMail.com outside of his Long Island home on Sunday, Dr. William Burke, 53, revealed that he will be pressing charges against his attacker. He denied knowing the irate man and refused to address his claims that Burke sexually assaulted his wife in 2016, but warned there's more to come. Yeah, that doesn't like. All right, let me continue finishing this because I was like, well, all right, there's more to come. A viral video from May 20th medical conference in Baltimore shows an audience member slapping the director of, gynecolo of gynecology oncology at Stony Brook on stage. And then, uh, do you know who the mystery attacker is? 
So Daily Mail is wanting to know who this mystery attacker is. The Stony Brook University Cancer Center doctor who was violently slapped during a medical conference late last month says he was he will indeed press charges, but refuses to address the attacker's claim that he sexually assaulted his wife in 2016. The only thing that obvious is that I was assaulted on the video, says Dr. William Burke told the DailyMail.com in an exclusive interview at his home on Sunday. The director of Oncology 53 uh, spoke out, uh, out while gardening in the backyard of his Tony Estate near the Long Island uh, Sound. He was joined by a woman believed to be his wife who was helping him with his yard work. Oh, Lord. I mean, I don't know if they just haunted him there and they said, can we get an exclusive interview? Because it doesn't look like he's very much in an interviewing mood. Speaking to Daily.com outside of the Long Island home with a woman believed to be his wife on Sunday, Dr. William Burke confirmed he will be pressing charges against his attacker. The director of oncology, there's another picture, responded to the incident while doing gardening work and his partner at his Tony estate. There are the pictures for those that did not see it um, right there. In a now viral video, an irate man is seen approaching the podium to slap uh, Burke multiple times while hurtling insults at him, accusing him of assaulting, sexually assaulting his wife at an ACOG in Baltimore on May 20th. Asked whether he will pursue criminal charges, Burke replied without hesitation, I will be. Okay. The physician, however, was less forthcoming when asked about the allegations made by the angry man in the audience and denied knowing him. I don't know who he is, Burke replied. I don't know his name. Wow. He also would not confirm whether or not he knew the man's wife or had any prior relationship with her. He referred those questions all, all others to a spokesperson for the Stony Brook University. There's more to come, he teased. Well, why would there be more to come if you don't know these people? Although Burke initially declined to press charges, a Baltimore police spokesperson told DailyMail.com on Monday that the doctor has up to a year to change his mind. Well, there you go. If he wishes to proceed, he would have to file a new statement of charges detailing what happened to the city court commissioner's office. Police with evidence uh, police with evidence that would include the video would then execute an arrest uh, and likely charge the perpetrator with common assault, a misdemeanor punishable for up to a year in jail. The attack took place on May 20th in Baltimore, where the doctor was serving as a panelist on a podium during the annual meeting of the American College of Obstetrician and Gynecologists. Lord have mercy, I am just not. Look at all these pictures that they got. Um, For those that are wanting more pictures. So he didn't confirm whether he knew there's the home. Lord, they even posted the house. Well, very nice house. They posted the house, the entryway. Okay. So the couple was seen returning to their beautiful estate with bags of potting soil for their garden. The acoustics of the room and nearby microphone ensure that every word is crystal, crystal clear for all to hear. With even the crack of each slap against Burke's face. Uh, wow. <laughs> <laughs> the audience member who has not been named could not be seen grabbing the doctor. Whoa, whoa, whoa. The audience member who has not been named could see, uh, could be seen grabbing the doctor by the shirt before slapping him with his hand. The confrontation captured on video has, uh, has since gone viral. This mother effer assaulted my wife seven years ago. We've repeated this. Uh, you know what you did. You touched my wife seven years ago in New York. Don't be a, a, an A bitch. Okay. A furious man goes on to declare the assault on the doctor as retaliation for men who have harmed women in such manner. Mm. In retaliation for men who have harmed. Mm -mm -mm. There's no notifications. Oh, my God. YouTube is doing me so wrong, you guys. You guys don't even know. I am not getting notified. People aren't getting notifications. I don't know why. I want to see where they filed the report she filed on the doctor. Remember, Chico, she did say that. Is he sure he really wants to go down this route? All the skeletons might come flying out of the closet. Right. I mean. So you'll be countersuing the doctor. Press. Everybody say press. I mean, look. 
look, I, that's, I guess this is what we had talked about this, right? So if so, where is the woman's claims at, right, Lisa? I mean, that's what we're all wanting to hear. What's going on? Uh, you know, and, and here's the deal, okay? Um, we don't know. There's probably details out there we don't know. She tried to file before. That's what she stated in the video. I'd like to see what they did with this report. Are there other people that have come out and said stuff about this doctor? Um, and nobody has done anything about it. Okay. I'm kind of curious to know as well. But, I mean, they captured everything. They hear daily... Dailymail.com is giving a whole transcript. And you could see the wife, I, I, and I'm assuming this is the wife, uh, given that she was the one seen and heard saying the stuff about what happened. Here is the cancer center. I guess this is where they had the uh, the whole, oh, no, this is uh, Stony Brook Medicine Cancer Center. This is where he's the director. He's the director, okay? So everybody's aware of it. I mean... Daily Mail wants you to email who is the who is the person that made the slap. Now this is interesting. I, I just I just checked this. Let me show you guys something. Remember how Law and Crime when we talked about this article yesterday, Law and Crime said that there was an account. And this is the Twitter account. I'm following it. They actually liked the video on. Uh, they hearted the video on Twitter. This is why we're live on Twitter right now. Uh, give me one sec, y'all. Give me one sec. One second. Sorry, I was just getting a call. Do you guys remember that account? And Law and Crime was like, there's a there's an account on Twitter, and um, this is where the video came from. Uh, everybody remember that, right? Daily, I know Daily Mail doing the most. Daily Mail was like, here's my email. Give me a clue. This is the Twitter account. Okay. Well. I'm looking, and they're following one person. So I click it, and it's uh, Sean Conan? John Conan. Let me see who this is. Followers you know. Senior reporter on the Daily Mail exclusive team's former NYPD or NY Post Police Bureau chief. Send news tips to Sean Cohen at mailonline.com. So followers you know. This is followers that I know. This account is being followed by the Daily Mail as well. Y'all notice that? So the Daily Mail is like, let me get on this exclusive right away. I mean, I, I okay. Um, and they're asking for tips as well. Let me see what else, what is going on um, else. So, I mean, they posted his information out there. So this is where the video was initially released. So everybody's aware of where this video came from. Tiger 1469. Okay. And they got 87 followers. So I'm one of them because I was like, let me get the information. But um, other people are following too. They're wanting to know what's going on. So mm -mm -mm. I don't know. Let me know your thoughts in the comments. I literally just came quickly to give you guys this little uh, update about what's going on with this story. So it looks like the doctor will be pressing charges. I'm kind of like to know what the developments are. Um, are there other people that are going to speak out against this situation as well? Uh, this man specifically, I mean, you know, he had up to a, a year to, to press charges. So, and, and I mean, if, if he feels like he says he doesn't know him, but says that the more will be able to come out. So what does that mean? So do you know him or do you not know him? Let, let me pull you guys. Let me pull. Let me, let me just ask you guys, let me start a little poll. Do you think Dr. Burke knows knows the slapper? Okay, let me let me know. Yes or no? Do you think he knows? Because the way he said that, he said that the more information is about to come out. And while you're voting, please hit that like button. Thank you. I'm curious to know. My freaking poll. <laughs> Amy's like not another poll. Amy. Do I know I'm going to do a poll about how much you love me. And I'm just going to put it up there and say, does Amy love me? Yes or no. Does Amy secretly love these polls? Yes or no. Y'all hate polls. I just want to know. All right. Do you think that he knows the slapper? <laughs> well, he's only pressing charges because he heard us saying he's obviously guilty. Right. Chico. I think somebody got into his ear. Like now my stuff is out there. Uh, you got YouTubers, you got TikTokers, you got 
Twitter people, you know, talking about it. I'm I'm going to do a poll on Amy and SW. Do they really hate polls? I know. I, well, it, Chico, man, Chico was on it. I didn't even see this one. But, you know, the Daily Mail is like everywhere, too. They're always trying to figure out what everybody's talking about, just like all of us over here, too. They're nosy like us. But let me tell you guys, in all seriousness, though, um, this is a very serious situation, right? Like, I hope that for the sake of truth um, and if there needs to be justice, either or, that the truth does come out. And if there's other people that aren't speaking out about this, that I hope that they do. Um, this is such an it just really tricky situation overall. I don't know. I don't know. I took the poll, but how would any of us know? We don't have a clue. That's right. That's right. You're right. But doctor said, Dr. Burke said that there's more to come out. So do you know the guy or do you not know the guy that slapped you? And then not only that, how did they say 2016? Like even, even when the slap, I mean, is that really seven years from 2023? Somebody do the math. I don't think that that is that would that be 2016? Lord have mercy. Let me pull a let me pull a calculator here. OK, I don't think that's seven years, is it? Or uh, 2016. Hold up. Uh, 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 uh. Yeah, that would be seven years. That would be seven years. You think the wife knew him? I think there's more to this. He hit him in the camera, so arrest him. OK, um, it is. OK, so it is. seven. So how do they? Well, if he said seven years and then they, they might have guesstimated 2016, I guess it would be 2016. I don't know. Right. 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 Amy, I said he knows if he knows if he didn't know the husband, he certainly knew what he was slapping for. Right. Why laugh? I'm just telling you, that is such a weird reaction to you're being assaulted in front of your colleagues. Somebody comes to you if you don't know him. You don't know them, right? You're like, where the fuck? Why, why is this person slapping me, right? I don't know. 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 But let me know your thoughts in the comments about this situation. Make sure you're hitting that like button. I'm going to head out. That was a nervous laugh. Let me hit the end poll. See, we got 25 votes in here. That's a little something, something. Uh, let me know your thoughts. I'm going to be heading now and uh, I will see you guys later on tonight because we are going live later on some other true crime uh, uh, topics as well. You guys have a great one. Rabbits out. <laughs>